Welcome back to Vlogmas. Tonight, I'm going to try this place called the Fish Bar. It is located in Waterloo. Their food looks really delicious. So, Deanna and I are actually heading there now. It's, it's actually 10 past 6 right now. So, hopefully, they end sell out. <laughs> but, I'm gonna check it out and I will show you guys the place. The ambience inside there is so nice. Um, it's like a gourmet grocery slash a little deli shop like i don't know i would show you guys but yeah so we are heading there i don't know the proper direction how to get to there i just know it's waterloo but you guys can check them out on instagram um the fish bar and yeah their stuff look really good like i went there once but they were closed and they're last year around the same time but they were actually closed because then and i went to get lunch and they closed for christmas so yeah hopefully tonight we get through and we get to try their food and i'll let you guys know if it tastes as good as it looks and you know the pricing and all of that so we're actually going to get barbecue tonight i would take you guys along and show you so come with me let's go to the fish bar to get some juice guys inside there it looks so nice the thing that we bought came up to 130 something 135 we bought a uh, barbecue lamb barbecue chicken and a two piece chicken and fries and that the barbecue comes with fried rice macaroni salad and noodles you guys know how it tastes and all of that hi they're so nice it's like so aesthetically pleasing like it's really really nice Alright guys, so this is the chicken cheese and fries with biscuits. Oh nice. Also condiments, ketchup, mustard. And this is the barbecue chicken. Alright. Alright guys, so this is my plate. I have some rice, macaroni salad under that, noodles fried chicken um biscuit fries i forget to take the barbecue chicken but i'll try that just now so i'm gonna taste that's the sun that you guys know what's right. up so i'm gonna try the biscuit first mm -hmm. biscuit kind of tastes like um church's biscuit i'm gonna try some of the rice Mm -hmm. I got some macaroni salad here. I don't like macaroni salad, but I'm still gonna try. It's good. Macaroni salad is good. Noodles. Mm. Noodles is great. Time for the chicken. Mmm. Really good. 
all right guys so it's the next day so i just wanted to give you guys a little review of the fish bar in terms of ambience the place is really nice like it's really small so it's like a narrow hallway as you guys seen in the in the clips before but it's just so cozy and they decorated so nice for christmas so, so aesthetically pleasing like it's so pretty how they decorate and plus inside this smells amazing like I think they had their diffuser on and it was peppermint that I was smelling and it smells so freaking nice. I love when places look really nice, but I also love when places smell divine. It was just giving me Christmas vibes. We have a lot of, you know, packaged meats so you can get like frozen lasagnas, um, patties, what else you can get? You can get a variety of stuff, frozen stuff. And there were also a lot of organic options. So visiting there and just seeing like the decor, the vibe in there is, is just like, for me, inside there felt like Christmas. <laughs> so yeah, ambience, 10 out of 10. Um, when it comes to the food, everything tastes nice. The only thing I would say though, it was pre-packaged. Ian is not really into breast meat. He don't like breast meat. So I usually eat breast meat. So that's no problem for me. But um, I prefer side breasts. Um, rather than like, you know, the whole center breast. But if I get the center breast, it's fine. I'll eat it as well. But he prefers leg and tie and their meals were pre-packaged. So that's the only thing I would say. Like I would like to see my food, like what I'm getting. You know, cause nicely in, you know, those um, cardboard box containers, which is, you know, environmentally friendly. But at the same time, I would still like to see what I'm getting in my food, if you understand what I mean. So in terms of the packaging, the packaging is really cute also i would like to see my meat options if i'm buying meat or like what i'm getting in the box that's the only thing food tastes nice with good flavors they can get like another container or something where you can actually like see your food like what you're getting in the box out of like 10 um the food was like maybe like a 7 out of 10 it it was good but it wasn't like wowing if you understand what i mean because i had the the two piece with the biscuit and fries fried chicken and that was good the biscuit was nice it kind of like reminded me of um of church's biscuit and the barbecue chicken it was okay it wasn't like the best barbecue chicken i had so um yeah but it was okay and yeah so the food is like seven out of ten but then it all depends on what you get so just with the packaging the packaging um could have at least shown the food like you know if you wanted a leg and tie or that kind of thing you know? yeah because i like to see my food when i'm buying it because like i like to sometimes and maybe this is wrong too because I, I like to watch stuff like food when it comes to food and if it looks good i'll buy it sometimes that doesn't always be the case uh, it looks really good and it don't taste good at all so but i still like to see what i'm buying i yeah you understand so i hope you understand definitely visit guys it's really nice maybe you can try something else and um let me know what you think if you ever if you ever visit there and you had food from there let me know what you had and how it was for you but i really enjoy the experience going to there i just love the ambience i will go again a lot of variety of like healthy foods and snacks options so i would definitely be going they also have like a whole dessert area so um yeah i will be checking that out as well so yeah this, and i forgot to mention the main thing which is price how could I forget something like that? <laughs> so, in terms of pricing, no, it's not really bad in terms of pricing because the lamb, like we bought lamb for my mother. She said it was good. It was, the lamb was soft and tender, which is always nice. I didn't try the lamb though, but um, she said it was good. <laughs> so, uh, the lamb, I think that was 55 give you guys a proper pricing but on their instagram page they have like all like their their meals they have their prices of each of their meals so um yeah but every day the three meals came up to 135 so yeah 
all right back to the video that's basically it i am drinking I open the advent calendar but first i am just showing you guys this is the one that i'm drinking here i'm having the super berry from the advent calendar let me try this and let you guys know what i think mm. this will drink better cold though like cool and you add like some honey or something to sweeten it but it's really nice hot as well let's go and open the advent calendar all right guys so time to open the advent calendar day six seven and eight now the days are getting mixed up because remember i had pre-recorded videos so those videos was already um scheduled to upload so yeah and just bear with me but i had the the super berries which i showed you guys in the previous clip and that was really good however that would have tastes better cold it tastes like um the cherry kool-aid so yeah and i still have the winter balance and some other one. Oh, and the acai and pomegranate but i think i'm gonna make the acai and pomegranate as like an iced tea so yeah all right so the last one that we did was five so we have six seven and eight <laughs> so now i'm gonna punch it with the nails but i have my keys here so i'm gonna do six um what is this one so this is cranberry and hibiscus rose hip seven this is a red cherry chai oh I wanted to try this so this is a red cherry chai and where is it um eat it is right here oh. um revive me <laughs> i think i'm gonna save this i'm gonna save that for when i really need a revival so yeah so guys i would see you on the next vlogmas video don't forget to stay safe stay blessed bye